Hi, I'm Stephen with MikeReynolds.com, and if you've been to our site, you'll notice that we have a great selection of microphones. But we do get questions about, hey, how do I separate one microphone from the next? I need help searching. Well, no problem. What we, we, we do is we break things down into four categories. The first of those is microphone type. The microphone types that we focus on are dynamic, ribbon, and condenser microphones. Today we're going to be talking about ribbon microphones. Ribbon microphones are known for their great studio vocal reproduction quality. Perfect for that application. However, they can be used to capture other instruments and they've also been known to make their way to the stage once in a while. Um, a ribbon microphone is similar to a dynamic in that it doesn't need a power supply. So when a ribbon mic is, differs with a dynamic is that it's more fragile. It has a flat frequency response with a better response to the high frequencies. So again, great for vocal reproduction. Ribbon mics can be expensive. The cheapest of those starting around about $1,000. Now, a great example of a ribbon mic at microreynolds.com is the Shure KSM313 Naked Eye, or NE, uh, where you can rent one for three days for about 100 bucks. So not too bad. Well, that wraps it up for ribbon microphones. I'm Steven with microreynolds.com.